Hi, students, Pete Estabrook here. I just wanted to do a little video on uh, the idea of clarity versus memory. These are two faculties that we have built in. We come uh, hardwired with these as humans. And um, I want there to be some understanding about how this works. Often I'll get students coming to me saying, I have to memorize some piece for a playing test, for an audition, for a concert, something like that. And they're really wound up about it. And I've probably talked about this before, you know, by the time I see them in a lesson, it's probably too late for me to help them. But really, the essential thing is just the conceptualization, the understanding of the difference and importance of each of these two elements. So basically, um, the good news about being a human is you learn things quickly. And the bad news about being human is you learn things quickly. Um, Basically, this recorder that we have in our head is, is on all the time. It's recording all information that we encounter, even things that we're not currently aware of. Um, as our uh, awareness or attention grows, um, the amount of information that we're picking up also increases. So um, there's various ways to expand that attention um, or uh, sharpen um, our tools of perception. But in the case of, of music, the more important element is really the clarity element rather than the memory element. Often we're in teaching music or in playing music, we're um, taught or rewarded to emphasize the memory aspect. And the problem is not that the information is not going into memory. It's, it's clearly going into memory. The problem is that our clarity is blocked, our clarity is muddled. And that clarity is often muddled just by our own anxiety about whether we have clarity or not, or whether we can remember something or not. So really the, of the two aspects, and of course there's many, many aspects um, to our makeup, but of these two aspects, memory and clarity, the clarity is the more important one because it's what allows us to access the memory. It's, a, it's what is basically, going to get us out of the situation where we've re we've put something in memory, but we can't retrieve it. So um, as far as I'm concerned, the clarity is the more important issue. The memory is already happening, and uh, we don't need to concern ourselves with whether that memory is, has taken place or, you know, that sort of thing, just that we want to access that memory. We want to bring our anxiety level down. Um, we want to kind of neutralize our, our nervous system so that it's not all jangled and um, preventing us from getting to what we already have. I hope that helps.